In this section, we will see an easy way to install Udo using a shell script called Udo install sh. This is the content of this script. We will see here that we are installing the Udo version 14. And for our folder, instead of Udo, we will say Udo 14 to make a difference with other versions. And for the port, we will use 8014. This is the, the changes that we'll add in our script. And then we will run it like this. The first thing that the script is doing is to update the Ubuntu system. And by the way, you will find uh, attached to this section this uh, script so that you can use it or you can change things in it as you want. Let us check if the port 8014 is already reserved or free. As you can see, the 8014 is free, which is good. So that after our installation, our system will be running in this port. The next thing that the script do is to install the Python uh, packages that we will need for our other server. And then we install the PostgreSQL database. And at the end, we download the Odoo server in our, in our operating system. Here, as you can see, those are the Python packages that we will need for our Udo system. So they are, we download them and we, we install them so that we can use them in Udo system. Here is the final step, we are cloning the Udo 14 server from GitHub and after that our Udo server will be running without any problem in the port that we already designed it. It's 8014. That's it. Now we can check again the, the our port 8014. As you can see here, this is the first uh, interface to create your first database. So everything is going well as we expected. And as you can see, we we only use it 
one script to install everything, which is really a quick and efficient way to install your Odo server. Here inside my folder Odo 14, I can see that I have two folders, the our Odo 14 server and our custom add-ons folder. And inside my Odo 14 server, I can see all these folders that are mandatory for running our system. Here in Odo 14 server conf uh, configuration, there is all the configuration that we need to, to run our Odo 14 server. That's it for this section.